Good morning, good evening, good night, wherever you are. Today I want to talk about colour. It's the 1st of December, so welcome to the 1st of December. I'm going to be doing quick tips uh, between now and the 24th of December every day. So if you want to learn more about Canva, if you're new here or whether you are a regular viewer of my channel but you're not quite subscribed yet, do click on the subscribe button down below, click on the bell notification icon. And between now and the 24th of December, I'm going to be doing a quick tip every day with some coffee. And I have no idea how you pronounce that. There you go. How would you pronounce that? Okay, I'm fully caffeinated now. I've drunk my coffee. I actually had my coffee with breakfast, so... Let's dive in and take a look at what we're looking at today. Today I want to have a look at colour in Canva and how you can use colour, select colour, find the right colours to go with your images and things like that. Far too many times I see people just kind of like slapping on a colour that just does not go with the image or the text or the design that they're trying to go with. So let's go into photos. What I've got here in Canva is just some images so let's say we wanted to pick this image here now i'm going to quick set that as the background image and we're not going to worry too much about the position what i want is just like the colors let's say i wanted to add some text up here so i want to add some text up here i'm just going to put uh, a heading you might be tempted to come up here and you'd be like well you know that's kind of like close and things like that however what you can do when you've clicked on this is you can come over to the photo colors so if i wanted to i could kind of like pick something that's close out of here and this is what canva is seeing as good tonal colors from within the image that will fit with the design and if you're not quite sure that those designs fit what you can also now do is you can actually choose and use the new color picker in canva now if you're not aware of this it's something that wasn't available on the desktop for some time but on the chrome browser and i think one of the other browsers i'm not sure which one i use chrome and i know it's available on that one so if it's not available on your browser have a go at doing it with chrome but all you do is you come into the normal color options up here click on this little plus icon here and then you'll have this now this color picker icon and you can come into the actual image and you could pick a color like this and it's then going to put it into your color palette so if i wanted to pick out a similar color to the shirt there i could do if i wanted to pick out something a little bit more orange on here so i think that kind of orange kind of picks out that a little bit more i could do the other option is i could pick the yellow option here and that kind of picks out the yellow more from there and that's one way of adding color what you can also do is add or come to your styles and you can add your colors into your uh, color palette i can come in and shuffle those those are from my color palette that i've set up under my branding guidelines which is on the main home page which you will find where will you find it you'll find it under brand kit here underneath the tools section go in there and you can set your colors and you can swap between brand kits as well now so i can have multiple brand. if you're a pro user you can have multiple brand kits if you've not tried pro i'll put a link down below to a 45 day trial so you can try pro um 45 get days gives you plenty of time to do these next 24 days with me play about with it um what else have we got with color you can come to color palettes there's all sorts of different color palettes here and you can just apply these color styles to that image if you wanted to within oh i've not seen that one you can now edit your brand kit within the actual menu there well, that's really good it used to be that you have to go out to the home page edit your brand kit there but now you can actually choose or edit your brand kit here and to get rid of these colors you just click on the x and that will get rid of it i can swap between different brand kits and come to better content creators and i can then come and pick the colors on those and edit them i can add in my fonts that's really good i didn't know that was there 
see learning with me every day okay i think that's everything for colors for today it's about choosing the right colors and finding the colors that match the image and it's going to give you a better overall kind of like aesthetic rather than coming in choosing heading and then just picking you know a bright blue color or something else like that that's not going to go with the aesthetic of the image that you're trying to create so yeah that's it give it a go let me know if you've got any comments down below about using color in canva and until tomorrow when we're all going to be having another coffee a bit more of a longer video tomorrow um it's all about editing video in canva choosing sound design and things like that that's all about tomorrow so if you are interested in that click on subscribe click on the bell notification icon i'll put links to tomorrow's video in the description and up here and everywhere so yeah until then thanks very much bye